Hey yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video and in this video we are here back inside of Bilbo once again and today we are going to be doing a pretty crazy video, a block that literally sends you gold. I'm not even kidding. Like I, I've covered this before and I have to show you guys it again because of how overpowered and broken this thing actually is. So I'm going to be showing you guys a tutorial in today's video so make sure you guys stay tuned. Also make sure you guys drop a like on the video and subscribe and stay tuned for more gold tips and glitches just like this one. So let's Let's go ahead and hop straight into the video. So I made a video about, I want to say like two months ago, where there's an actual block in game and a glitch that you can use with this block that'll literally allow you to touch it and literally get gold inside of the game. Now you're probably wondering like, okay, Fusion, it's probably just going to be this chest right here because if you blow this thing up, it drops a gold bar, whatever. No, guys, it's not this at all. And it's something that literally every single person can do if you have the right stuff. And I cannot wait to show you guys, but I want to give a huge shout out to Fluffy for actually finding this thing if you guys want to go subscribe to his channel it'll be linked down below inside the description so make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe to him down below so what we're actually going to do to start off with this glitch is we are going to take anchor block off okay that is the first thing you guys need to do then you guys just want to place a seat just like this and this glitch is very very easy and it's very quick to do as well you just gotta stay tuned and see how to do it so we're gonna sit down inside of the seat just like this actually now we're not gonna sit down we're just gonna go down here inside of our inventory wait how did anchor block get turned back on what in the world all right, so we're going to place a cake right on the edge of the seat just like this. You don't want to place it on the middle of the seat, just right on the edge. So that way it looks just like this, and then you should be good to go. So from here, guys, what you want to do is grab a block and place it on the end of the cake. And I think you might need the skill tool for this. I'm not entirely too sure if you need it or not. But anyway, we're going to place a block just like this on this end, and then we're just going to scale it out. Now, it doesn't really matter how long you scale this thing. I'm just going to make mine a decent size. You can probably make this thing way bigger if you wanted to but i'm just gonna go with this size right here this should be good for the video all right so then what i'm gonna do is i'm going to go ahead and grab another spring inside of my inventory and we're gonna place this thing right on the back of the build all right so right about there you kind of want to line it up right with the seat so that way it's even so once you guys have this thing placed down then what you guys want to do from here is just grab any block it really doesn't matter which one you use i'm just gonna use the plastic block and you're gonna place it right on the end of the spring just like that so you want your overall thing to look like this and once it looks like this you should be fully almost done But the last part you guys need to do is actually connect this to the bottom You can see right here how this is scaled almost on the bottom We're just going to connect this that way the block connects to the ground and the platform at the same exact time And you can see how everything is levitated off the ground except for the seat And that is what you want and also this block of course now if you guys want to you can save I do recommend it because if you build this, you know every single time it's going to get a little bit tiring to build So I do rec- are you serious? I pressed load and not save. Are you kidding me? All right, now I have it saved, so we should be good to go. I had to rebuild it back up because I accidentally just deleted everything. So now we're gonna get this thing set up so that way it literally gives you gold. And you guys will not believe this, and this will actually get you a lot of gold. So that way, if you're playing the new update in build and you wanna buy yourself some more gifts before the update goes away, I recommend doing this because like I said, this can make you a ton of gold by literally almost doing nothing. All right, so once you have it fully saved up, we're just gonna sit on the seat just like this we're gonna delete that cake but then we're gonna replace it down this is just to hold everything together and like i said this is super easy so then once you reconnect the cake right there then we can actually remove this block and then we're going to take a butter block is the next step so then we're gonna take the butter block we're gonna place it kind of like right in the middle of the seat we're gonna try our best to get it uh right on the edge of the cake right there and then from there the last step is just basically putting a hinge block right about here and once you guys have fully set up just like this now we're gonna set this thing up and you guys will see how overpowered this thing is. Alright, so we're gonna delete this chair right here, and uh, then you guys can see how we're flying just like this. So I think you actually need to place that butter block, like, in the direct center of the block, because if you don't, then it's gonna happen just like how you guys saw to me. That is what's probably gonna happen to you. Alright, so you guys can see right here, we're gonna read to this here. I'm gonna sit down here. I'm gonna show you guys this once again, just because I messed up. We're gonna place the cake inside just like this. We're gonna delete this block, and then go down inside of our inventories, grab the butter butter block it has to be the butter block guys and then we have to get this thing in the middle right there boom there we go that's right in the middle of the block then we're gonna place the hinge right there all right so then we're gonna delete the seat and then we can climb up and down and just like this and watch how overpowered this thing is so we're basically just gonna fly through the first couple of stages okay when we're past the first couple of stages this is going to get super easy and you guys will start to make a ton of gold very very quickly all right so once you guys are actually inside of the stage right here you guys will notice that uh you 
just want to be on like the very edge of the stage and what you guys want to do from here is go click on the plastic block and then just anchor this thing all right that's all you guys want to do is anchor it and then we guys want to grab your scale tool click on it just like this and then click on one of the orange dots i'm just going to push the top one just like that and it's going to like inch off of the spring just a tiny bit and that's exactly what you want to happen all right, now we should be able to move up and down. All right, so it worked right here. We can move up and down. So what we actually want to do from here, guys, is we want to fly back over to our plot. And we want to take it all the way, like, back towards the spawn points because that's where we want to set this platform down. And I cannot believe this glitch is still inside of the game. So basically, what we're going to end up doing is touching this block every single time. And it's going to teleport us to the stage and instantly give us gold. It's literally that easy. Now, you can actually make this block long enough so that way it covers the entire spawn. It'll be a little bit harder to do, but you could do it. All right, so we need to get this thing lined up so that way we can take it down here. All right. Right, I gotta get this thing perfect because I do not want to mess this thing up So we're just gonna basically just climb down here just like so and like I said You guys can make this block like cover the entire spawn area if you wanted to it would take a little bit more time Probably but I'm just gonna go like this pop the butter block I'm gonna delete this cake So this platform is the thing that we just need to touch So if I go over here and I reset my character just like this you guys will notice how I'll get some gold from going inside of the stages All right, so you guys can see right there. I am going to get dun 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 54 gold just like that now you guys are probably wondering like okay that's because you went through the first stages but if i go like this look at i haven't gone through any stages i'm gonna stand on this reset and i get teleported to the stage literally instantly and you guys will see how much gold i get right here i believe it's about 36 or yeah 36 gold right there now all i have to do is just walk over to this platform again reset just like this and it's just going to keep teleporting me over inside of the stage over and over again and uh it's gonna be awesome like look at that we just got teleported right there 36 gold don't mind if i do now like i said for like three different times you can make this thing bigger so that way you don't have to keep walking over to the platform uh because you can notice how i'm just walking over to it and resetting just like this but there's a way in which you guys can just scale it out and just that way it covers the entire spawn area So you don't have to keep walking over to it because that could be a little time consuming But it gives you 36 gold every single time you do this And if you do this for a while, you can get yourself a ton of gold very very quickly now The new present inside of the game is 20 gold So every time you do this you basically just get one present plus extra gold almost two presents every single time you do this So it's very beneficial and you could get a ton of gold off of this very very quickly if you do this for a long period of time but yeah guys hopefully you did enjoy this video make sure you guys go ahead and drop a big thumbs up and make sure you guys subscribe to the channel with that notification bell and i'll see you guys all later peace out and goodbye